Moving on, West Sports Holdings CEO Ruben Amir Nalingam said that China's rejection of the mega alliance of the P3 alliance, comprising the world's three biggest container shipping companies, CMA, CGM, Musk Line and Mediterranean Shipping Company, has removed uncertainties on the company's container throughout prospects. The P3 alliance had raised concerns that CMA, CGM, West Sports' biggest customer may move its transshipment hub from West Sports to Port of Tanjung Pelepas. PTP in Johor. This could negatively impact Westport's throughput and revenue as Miask Line has 30% stake in PTP, which is already the shipping company's transshipment hub. Rubin said that the alliance would have minimal implication for the throughput business of the company, but the cessation of the proposed alliance removes the uncertainties for the company. Westports reported a 2.4% rise in net profit to 122.49 million ringgit for the second quarter and at June 30, 2014, from 119.58 million ringgit in the corresponding period a year earlier on higher container throughput. Lower cost of sales and administrative expenses also supported the port operator's profit growth. Net profit for the first half climbed 16.7% to 231.53 million ringgit, from 198.4 million ringgit a year ago on higher container throughput growth, termination of management service agreement and lower effective tax rate. Revenue was 2.9% higher at 772.18 million ringgit, from 750.08 million ringgit a year ago. Westport said total container throughput in the first half of financial year 14 rose 12.9% year-on-year to 4.02 million 20-foot equivalent units TEUs led by transshipment and indigenous cargo which rose 13.9% and 10.5% respectively.